Good day. Ken Chan again from Swisspack Resources in Ambahat. Today I'm going to share with you on how to do a IPsec VPN tunnel from Ruijie RGO 1600-Z3200-S to 4 gate FGT60F. From this diagram you can see that this is how is the whole network is connected. This is currently the network that currently I'm in the at home and it's running and this is my office network which is powered by 40 gate 60 f now I'm going to connect these two locations together via an IPsec secure tunnel however do not afraid that the even though different brand both will still work under the same common IPsec uh, algorithm which is we call it the Cisco algorithm so to start off I'm going to configure the 40 gate firewall site first. As usual, you log into the to the firewall, and then go to the VPN, go to IPsec wizard. So from here, I call it uh, to can to side to side. No net between site because for, uh, firewall to firewall. So choose Cisco. Next, the remote IP address is uh, once seven five dot one four one dot one three nine dot one two seven. I'll go interface. I'm going to use my modem port, the Maxis. Preset key. And click next. So local interface, I will take it to go into my internal network. 192.168.0.0 slash 23, which is equivalent to 255.255.254.0. Remote. It's 192.168.110.0 Internet access, I want to use my own. I don't want to use the internet connection from my from my home or share, no share local. Next. Done. Now we're going to configure the Ruijie site. At Ruijie firewall login or the con control panel, this is the main page. Go to network, go to IP site VPN, go to config wizard. Start from here. So simply give this an ID. I put it number one. I call it to I call it office. So scenario, we're going to use it point to point. So if you're going to make this a head or the the main or which you have multiple office that are going to connect back to this reach air firewall, you should choose point to multi point. So in our case, it's just one-to-one -one from office to my home. Just put, put it point-to-point. Point. So the address, the peer address would be the one IP of my office. So that would be one two one dot one two two dot. 69.121 outbound interface make sure you choose the the dot 500 or the one that you are connecting to your internet and press ping success so the key will be the same preset key that you key in at the 48 
click next so here you need to create the local and the remote network just click create subnet to subnet local network would be 192.168.110 dot zero slash twenty four and peer network will be my office network one nine two dot one six eight dot zero dot zero slash twenty three and click OK click next config verification nothing just leave it click finish So we are done. Let's see whether are we able to bring up the tunnel. To start. Okay, let's check where go wrong. Go to custom tunnel. Click edit. Peer ID authentication have to turn on. Choose user FQDN. the custom panel after that you will need to check from here click next click next okay double check this part enable this add in des click finish And then another thing that is, uh, since my office is running on uh, dynamic IP, which every time the modem restarts, I need to get a new IP. From here, we better change it to the domain name. So from here, I change to com, which is my office dynamic domain name. Access. Next, next, finish. Go to tunnel monitoring. Try to start the tunnel. So after change the domain name, make sure you check the security, make sure that it is correct. Next, okay, make for 40 gate is pretty straightforward now. You remember this. The first one is IKEV1, then encryption is set to AES128, SHA, group 5. Uh, the rest is just maintain and then here DES AES128 and then enable perfect for forward secrecy. So let's compare this to our 40 gate site setup. This adds 40 gate. You see now nah, edit algorithm phase one proposal AES128 SHA1 and then group 5 and then click OK. Here already show up and click, click finish. And then go to tunnel monitoring. Take start. 
There you go. It's already up. So let's try to access our server internally. Oops, sorry, wrong address. Seven slash four. Thanks for watching. Please click subscribe and click give me a like if you're happy with the video. Thanks.